Hello and welcome to the Intrusion Detection and Prevention course for AWS. The topics of discussion are what is the difference between IDS and IPS? Also, what is the difference between host-based intrusion prevention and network-based intrusion prevention? Given the various AWS architectures, how do you place an IPS? How do you write rules? And how do you respond to the incidents that have been detected? And finally, the partner solutions available for intrusion prevention with Amazon Web Services. Who should attend this course? This course is targeted at cloud security specialists, cloud architects, and security incident responders, typically in an AWS environment. This is a pretty basic course and it's targeted at developers or operations engineers looking to deploy security solutions. Two plus years of experience in IT security compliance and risk management is definitely helpful so as to get a good understanding at the fundamentals of why a particular intrusion prevention device is placed in a particular place in the architecture. Networking fundamentals are a must, especially for rule writing. Packet ana analysis also helps us in better understanding uh, incidents. Understanding of different AWS architectures is particularly useful because I will be talking about the placement of intrusion prevention devices in these different types of AWS architectures. What you will gain from this course, you will be able to distinguish between intrusion prevention and intrusion detection and have an idea of knowing when to use which. You will be able to distinguish between host-based and network-based IPS and IDS. You will have a basic understanding of rule writing because most products today come with about 90% of the rules already pre-written. So all you will be required to do is to have a knowledge of add new rules to kind of customize the IDS or the IPS to in your environment or take an existing rule and customize it to your environment. You will have a basic understanding of how to respond to incidents that have been detected by your IDS or IPS. The meat of this course will focus on the different AWS architectures available and how the placement of the IPS and the IDS devices will vary with each one of these flavors. At the end of it, you will have a basic and fundamental understanding of how to place the IPS and IDS given any non-complex network architecture. We will also focus on the partner solutions available for IDS and IPS on AWS. A little about myself, my name is Vish Chidambaram. I'm an enterprise security architect and a trainer. I have about 12 plus years of experience in the security industry and about 20 plus years of experience designing enterprise architectures. I've shared my LinkedIn page. And if you are interested in contacting me, either to give me feedback or to have me conduct any customized courses for yourself or for your organization, I can be reached at info at datacoreacademy.com.